With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let's start the question. The question says that a vertical stick 10 cm long casts a shadow 8 cm long. At the same time, a tower casts a shadow 30 meters long. Determine the height of the tower. So in the question, they are saying that a vertical stick is there of height 10 cm which casts a shadow 8 cm long. And at the same time, a tower is casting a shadow 30 meters long. We need to determine the height of the tower. So here we have drawn the diagram. We have taken AB as the vertical stick. And its height is given to us as 10 cm. Then we have taken BC as the shadow of the stick. So BC is shadow of stick. And it is equal to 8 cm. Then we have taken ED as the tower whose height has to be found. So let ED be the tower. And here CD is the shadow of the tower. CD shadow of tower which is equal to 30 meters. So here we can see all the measurements have been given to us in centimeters. So we will convert even this 30 meters into centimeters. So this will be CD equal to we know 1 meter equal to 100 centimeters. So 30 meters will be equal to 30 into 100 which is equal to 3000 centimeters. Now we will see in triangle ECD and triangle ACD. So in the bigger triangle and the smaller triangle we will see that the angle C is common to both the triangles. So we can write angle C equal to angle C. Reason is it's a common angle. Then here we know that angle ABC and angle EDC both are 90 degrees because the stick and the tower are standing vertically to the ground. So we can say angle B and angle D are equal to 90 degrees. And the reason is tower and stick are vertical. So therefore when two angles are equal, equal, we can say that triangle ECD is similar to triangle ACD and the reason is AA similarity rule. By this rule the triangles are similar. So when two triangles are similar, their corresponding sides will be in the same ratio. So we can write in similar triangles corresponding sides are in same ratio. Therefore, we can write the ratio as EC by AC is equal to CD by BC is equal to ED by AD. But here we are interested only in the second and the last ratio because we need to find the measure of ED, the height of the tower and we have been given the measures of CD, BC and AD. So, we will take CD by BC is equal to ED by AB and we will substitute the values. So CD is 3000 centimeters by BC is 8 centimeter equal to ED we don't know the value by AB is 10 centimeter now we will cross multiply. So this will be 3000 into 10 by 8 equal to ED. So, 3000 into 10 is 30,000 by 8 equal to ED. 
So upon division, we will get this value as 3750 cm is equal to ED. So we can convert this into meters by dividing by 100. We will get this as ED equal to 37.5 meters. So thus we can conclude. Therefore, height of tower is 37.5 meters. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITJ and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.